everyone and welcome back to another Fallout 2 video and today I am once again trying to get past the battle that is never ending it seems like but I have my plan that keeps me alive for longer than just rushing in there okay so I discovered last video that taking nine steps back is too far and staying put is way too close so I'm going to move four spaces this way I was debating whether or not to to move four or five because nine divided by two is four and a half and given how this is a kind of like a grid, I can't move half a space. So just move forward, <coughs> see what happens. So it looks like they might be, I, yep, they are aggro. They are aggro. Are... I, I wonder how many of them I have a, in terms of getting their attention. Like, there's allies like that one and that one, that one, and that, that person, that person, and I believe this person right here are all allies. Now, the person that shot me with the gun, oh, that person as well. Uh, well, that person's not. Why are my allies running away? There you go, Sulik's now fighting. Took a while for Sulik to actually get involved in battle. Okay, so I have these two healing items. Ah, uh, Yeah, I don't wanna... I think I'm good. I'm gonna try to let them come toward me one at a time. That, that's the more ideal situation. But, of course, in life... Nothing's really ideal. So... It just... It is what it is, man. Okay, so it looks like at least those two, I, I can't tell what this person is. Maybe this person is a friendly that's fleeing from the scene. Uh, I can't quite remember. Yep, just as I thought they were friendly. Well, they are friendly, but they're like, <laughs> they're scared. They're too scared to participate. And I get sniped again for a third time. With a pistol. Well, not really sniped, but I get hit with a pistol. From... Well, my cursor's not on screen. But from as far to the edge of the enemy as you can. Those two have shot me three different times now. From that distance without missing a single time. I don't understand how. I mean, if I tried to shoot them from this distance, I would probably critically miss and hit myself in the head. Oh! Great 
Great job, allies. Doing well. <coughs> oh my god. Well, one of them died. But hey! One of the enemies that that was on me got killed. So I'm ecstatic about that. I am ecstatic about that. Did that enemy just say, just leave and I won't get hurt? I was about to say, they're missing all their hits. They were for a good bit. I mean, look at that feed. Well, when it's my turn, I will look at it more so, but... Oh, that slag's dead. And I just got hit again. Because it's like... Slag missed. Slag missed. Slag missed. Oh my god. But... I need to use my last healing item. Oh, dang it. I'm out of action points. Slag missed. Slag did not miss that time. Why does the ally sound like that when the slags miss him? I don't get it. Okay, they finally missed an attempted shot on me. Sure, we're still up against a couple humans, but we're mainly up against slag at this point, I think. And from what I understand, these slags don't have a high chance to hit. Finally, I was the beneficiary of an attempted shot. really hoping that one would have died. I wonder how much health that one particular slag has. It can't be too much. Almost dead. Dead. Yes. Maybe. <laughs> I have no more healing items, though. sound really obvious, and I get that. Well, yeah, it's gonna seem even more obvious now, but... The darkness of the afterlife is have all I not gotten you hit know. from those two... May you find more bull crap in that world. Or those three actually... Well, th three, actually. Bullcrap shots early on in the fight? 
I would have been in a lot better position than just having 8 health and no more healing items. That part of it does not make me happy, but the fact that my plan is working makes me so optimistic. Now, in a sense, I don't exactly like that because I have a feeling that me being optimistic will come back to bite me later. But who knows? I mean, the sports teams that I root for are not very good, so I try not to get too optimistic. And when I do get optimistic, It just, it all comes crashing down metaphorically, and it's not a good feeling to have hope and then have it ripped away from you. So that's why I'm very, I'm, I'm a little bit concerned. I, I should be more cautiously optimistic, and I will be. I will be. Okay, only ten. Okay, that human's going to engage with me. the game has been responding today so that I can kind of see what's going on and, and so that all of you can as well. Did I just get shot again? Dead, gammit. Mm. I'm gonna heal myself this turn. Okay, uh, I had lost 21, so I'm only down four. Well, hit points, that is. In case you don't know what I was talking about. I'm sure you did, but just in case. Ooh! My god! Oh, just one hit point? Well, I still wouldn't be too happy if I critically missed and took one point of health damage. I know where I'm focusing my attacks, though. <coughs> That's for sure. Okay. Yes! Oh, you hit me for 19. I believe you pose the greatest threat to me. You tore something up inside me. Well, I was trying to think of a joke to make, but... 
nothing quite came in a timely manner. And part of a good joke is the timing. So... I was hit again. Oh my god. I thought I had a spear. I thought I had a weapon on me. But I feel like at some point my inventory was basically stripped from me. Well, beyond the very beginning. Which is, by the way, where I believe the Vault 13 Canteen would be. Now, in terms of a spear, you are given a spear when your cousin in, in Arroyo trains you ha with how to use a spear. You are given one. I have no idea where that could have gone. No idea. So you would be correct in saying that if you've been watching the series and that you know that oh, the enemy is retreating. It's limping, too. Do they normally limp? I think so. This definitely keeps me alive a lot longer. Yeah, I, I would definitely much rather have one or two attempts that last a few minutes, or like 10 minutes. As opposed to several attempts throughout a 24 minute video. Because it used to be like six or so attempts, four. And it would just kind of break me somewhat because it'd be like, okay, well, I'm having to load in four to six different times of video. But now, it's not that bad. It's not that bad. Jesus Christ. You have died. Your quest to find the Garden of Eden and return it to your village has failed. Well... I say that and then right after I die. Sometimes I really feel like I should bite my tongue. And just not say anything. Yeah, that's a day pass. I think I might have sold the spear, actually. For more money. Or for more caps. Yeah, I think it's money in this one. Yeah, it is. Fallout 2 is weird compared to Fallout 1. But... Oh well, they're both good games, and I would argue that Fallout 2 is better. Which some people, not knowing the games, might be like, how? How can you really distinguish Fallout 1 and Fallout 2? They look exactly the same. There's just no response I would give to somebody like that. I would just assume that they haven't played the older Fallout games and just feel like the need to argue why would be pointless because they haven't 
experience them at all so they wouldn't know what I'm talking about when it came to an argument. 20 points? <coughs> Jesus. That's a lot. Okay. Ah! The protector critically missed and dropped his weapon. Yeah. It, it's a good recipe, though. Since it's an enemy, it's, it's good. It's good. I like it. I think four tiles is the... Right distance to move back, by the way. You know, part of how Fallout 2 can be a bit weird in the naming conventions is that I believe Slag are just ghouls. But they're not called ghouls. So it's just, it's, it's just weird. Wait, I... Okay, I only gained nine. So I'm 21 down. There we go. I don't think I healed as much that time as I have on the other attempts, but... Oh, well. <sighs> I'm... Yeah, that, that feed of... Slag mist, slag mist, slag mist is always funny and it will never get old. It is just too funny to see just something because it's if if they are technically ghouls, then they're technically zombies, which means their their brains are basically irradiated, which means they basically have no brain, so I can't call them somebody, but some things uh, miss that much and be that terrible. It's just funny to me. Uh, no, I don't want to open that up. Uh, strong kick? I hit the inventory button. <coughs> oh my god! That thing continued to slide. Jesus. my skills were better but I I haven't 
built too many characters in Fallout 2 before, so. Or played it a lot before I started playing it on this channel. So, I didn't really know what kind of playstyle I wanted to go for. Bam. Nope, not quite. Aww. Dead gummit. if I'm going to survive another turn or not. <sighs> That's the thing. I, I I just don't know. Well, beyond this next turn I'm going to get. I'm, I'm probably going to die next turn. Wait, the, the human hasn't attacked yet, hasn't he? I don't think he has. If he hasn't, that makes me super concerned. Okay, well, I guess I do get another turn. Okay. I I do believe I'm going to die on this turn now. I mean, come on, the slags were able to hit one time each. Surely the human will be able to hit me at least once, which will basically, uh, kill me. One successful hit might not. No, it did not. One successful hit did not kill me. Well, alright. I guess the human's dead. This is never say never, but this is a long shot. Thank you, Slag, for putting me out of my freaking misery. But, oh well. <coughs> I guess I mocked him for not being able, able to hit at all, and when I really needed them to not be able to hit me, they were able to hit me. I guess... <sighs> Am I surprised that my luck did that to me? Absolutely not. Absolutely not. But... I guess... Don't mock. I guess that's a lesson we can all take away from this today. See us, guys. I do believe that that will do it for this Fallout 2 video. And thanks, Fallout 2 video. I will see you all later. Goodbye, guys. Thank you all for watching.